I'm John Lash, class of 2025. I'm a left-handed pitcher and first baseman. I go to Charlotte Christian School and play with the South Charlotte Panthers. I'm uncommitted and this is a day in the life. I got into baseball, I would say, around five or six years old. Um, I really started to take it serious though, at about age 13, um, after my little league season. Um, that's when I started playing travel ball, and so I've been in travel ball about three years now. Um, I'd say the biggest influence on me in playing um, would definitely be um, probably, probably my dad, um, just because he played that growing up as a kid. Um, so that's why, why I started playing off young, but I mean, as I grew older and got more into it, 13U, um, I mean, I just fell in love with the game kind of, and you know, kind of fell into my body a little bit, and kind of things just started taking off from there. For me to commit to a college, um, I'm looking for a great coaching staff that I can build a relationship with on and off the field along with um, players to do the same with a good organization um, that has a reputation not only of um, being competitive on the baseball field but having good people um, in the classroom as well. Um, I'm looking for uh, you know college to develop me to the next level. Um, obviously it's huge and important to win but you know develop me as a player um, and also you know hold me to a high my character that's one thing I really take seriously in myself so making sure I have good character um, and that they they're the same way I feel like there might be a little bit, um, especially this year, you know, it was, um, you know, hard, but fun at the same time, you know, playing with alongside, you know, seven division one players, um, you know, definitely it's, it's a different feeling, you know, being a freshman uncommitted out there, but, you know, I know my time will come, um, you know, when, when I find that right college, you know, that suits me the best. Um, but I mean, I just go out there and play my game, do my thing. Um, and I don't, you know, worry about um, what college I want to go to or things like that. Um, you know, I'm still, you know, focused on where I want to go, um, and that doesn't change. So. I feel like my biggest strength I bring to the game um, is not only you know um, what I do to my teammates, you know, and how I um, uplift them and encourage them um, in practices and in games, um, but also um, you know my my bat and you know how I incorporate the lineup, whether it's just you know do my job and my at bat, uh, find barrels, and you know um, not just worry about you know getting hits and home runs stuff like that, but you know just having quality at bats for my team. Um, and then doing my job in the field, kind of being a team player, fitting that role. For me, the biggest strength, I feel like, um, I mean, my biggest weakness, I feel like I could work on the most, um, is definitely, um, you know, just being smart and feeling out the game, um, you know, what needs to be done. I mean, there's always those little details, those little things that you miss out on. Um, and being smarter, I feel like, you know, I could um, work on those things a little bit. Um, and then when it comes to me on the mound, um, you know, just having a better pace within myself and holding my emotion in better. Um, and not showing anything on the mound like that.
Alright, two. Uh, my top two favorite players in the MLB right now would probably have to be Blake Snell um, and Max Freed. Both of those guys, I feel like I, I see similarities in myself, the way they pitch, the way they move on the mound. Um, obviously, they're both lefties and can bring it um, with different pitches at different levels. So um, those are two guys I, I look up to and um, you know try and play a little light. My favorite baseball memory so far, um, it's a tough one, but I'll probably have to say um, last fall when I was at the Perfect Game Select Festival, uh, just being in that environment um, and with those guys, I mean, those are extremely talented guys. I mean, um, and we gotta do more than just baseball. Um, bond with people like that. I mean, those are memories that last forever. Um, so it's a really cool environment. And to be at that stage um, in that environment is, is pretty cool too. My mindset when I'm when I'm going up to the mound uh, to pitch, um, I just try and stay composed, stay locked in on what I'm trying to do, not worry about the 
outside analytics, what people are saying, what they're doing. Um, just focus on my craft um, and what I what I do. You know, get people out, what the game plan is, stick to that type of stuff. Um, who I'm facing, um, all that good stuff, and just you know, trust what I trust what I've worked on, what I put the work in every single day, um, and 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 let that shine. Start of the day off um, today in the cage. Um, got a little T work soft toss in to warm us up. Then got some nice BP out here on the field. Um, took it over to first base. Worked on some little things like picks, throws a second, stuff like that. Brought it over um, to the to the bullpen. Got a little working over there, um, touching up on some things. Um, and that's a day in my life on the baseball field.